I, people try to ask us all the time, how did you get on Dancing with the Stars? And majority of the dancers on Dancing oh. with the Stars is because of this guy right here, of That's Louis true. Van Amstel. He hey is, he actually is the reason why I married my husband. Wow. So he wow. is the full well, reason. Well, okay, if you, you started this whole subject. So let me tell you, we signed a contract. Right. And this, li this innocent, lovely, young Mormon girl, my butt, is the only one that got in trouble with her contract and got her, now husband Mike, fired from his job. And hmm. I didn't know because it didn't say. No, sure you didn't know. I honestly did not know. I really think I did not know. I was just like, he's just kind of cute. And now you're married eight years and four kids later? Yeah, nine years and four kids later. Nine years and four but, kids later. I'm jealous. Yeah. You guys, Louie is the main reason why I actually have gotten so far in my dancing was because of Louie and because I got in the show because he's the one who approached me. Do you remember? I remember it. I was You're, in Studio One. Yes. Okay. And I asked such a you to good come memory. and put the phone in to, your ear and say, you here. And never say no. Yeah, you didn't. You were like, Ashley, you're going to say yes to whatever they say to you. And I was like, okay. I didn't even know what she was going to say. And it was the whole TV show. And he was the whole reason why. And that would never have happened if the lady across the room wouldn't have pounded me for five years oh, to come to that's Utah. Right. That's true. In 1996, mother. Miami, mother, Miss Kim mother. Del Grosso. It's not if it weren't for you... I would never have come to Utah. I know. If it wasn't that you were such a beautiful dancer, I would never have well, approached you. How come it's not focusing? <laughs> I would have never met Louie if it weren't for Kim. I know. There you go. He had never come here and then been on the show. And That's right. <laughs> you well, did. <laughs> you are the whole reason we're all together, man. I came out of this. <laughs> That was so funny. It's a family vlog, Louie. It's a family vlog. Well, it's yeah. family matters. I think Louie is the reason that most of the people are on the show, to be honest. That is, that's what I said. Oh, Louis you're is, sweet. But it is the well, truth, Louie. It's Louis. so true, though. You know that. He's the one that had the vision. No, he, he had He had the vision. Too. He had the connections. Oh, you're they sweet. Saw him. You're it's sweet. It's true. It's about time that the world knows. I know. That's why I was so glad Louie was coming over, because that is the full truth to the whole show is because of him. And they approached you first, didn't they? They came They up called to you. me from England, Joe Sunker, who is now the current uh, co-executive yeah, producer. co-executive. And he's still there. Yeah, and he was my first interview too. And, and mine too. On the show. And he made me say things that I didn't really Yeah, and me like. too. Oh. <laughs> and if they put my interview up, it'd all be like, I know how to beat Louie. I know all of his tricks. Whoa. So that was pretty much my interview because hey, he, man. they were putting us to it, but he beat me. <laughs> have a great night we're gonna teach him how to do this so subscribe below if you've not subscribed yet and give us a big thumbs up and hope you guys have had a great holiday season two thumbs up two happy thumbs new up. year happy new year oh my gosh this is such a great like end of the new year so hopefully 2016 is gonna be the best and it will be for you guys you can talk mm -hmm. okay <laughs> my friends just left and it was so fun to have them here um, one of Louie's really good friend that she was here, Mary yeah, you Margaret. you guys remember her. She's like her. the best. She was in the... 
Dawson's Creek. She was Creek. in Dawson's Creek, and I was a big fan. Yeah, she was um, his mom in Dawson's Creek, and she is literally the nicest lady ever. And her husband yeah. is probably one of my favorite people in this world. He was so sweet. Yeah, he was a really cool guy. Raul was awesome. They were mm -hmm. great. It was really fun to have him here. It fun. makes me want to break out the old Dawson's Creek DVDs. I know. You. Uh, he was so excited the whole time. He I was can, a big fan. He was just. She was great. She I was know. really She's good a great in that. Actress. It was a great show. Dawson's Creek was a good show. Yeah. But I grew up on Cape Cod, and Dawson's Creek took place in Cape Cod. So for me, it was like a show about my hometown. Yeah. It was cool. And I was working in the TV industry, and I used to, every time, every, what was it, on like Wednesday nights or Thursday nights, we started watching it because some of the girls on the, in the dorm like floor, the same floor as I, would just show up at my room and watch Dawson's Creek. And I wasn't really paying attention, I'd be doing homework. And, and then there were like two weeks in a row into the, like, the first season when they didn't show up to watch the show. Mm -hmm. And then they showed up another week later. And I found that I was like way, uh, I didn't know what was going on. So I was asking, I was like, wait, why is you know he not with her or whatever? And then I was hooked, I was like, oh. And I started watching it on my own. It was like, I, I hey, had no idea. thumbs up if you like Dawson's Creek. I know, now I, I do, I we, love that show. Yeah, it was really good. We should do a Dawson's Creek like thing. And get together. I know, well I have, we're What's gonna. What's James Vanderbeek doing now? Who knows? But I'm sure Mary Margaret knows. Tonight was a full on like, actually teaching them about what we do and it was it they was had a lot of questions so, it was they cool. did and it was so fun but thanks to you guys we're actually able to tell them about this amazing world mm -hmm. so i don't know it's fascinating to them so it's so cool just to help other artists and creators kind of yeah and the neat thing about what we do is you guys as the fans you make it yeah. You make it really special and you make it the new choice form of entertainment is going to be people creating their own mm -hmm. stuff throughout the world. The creators that are making content now mm -hmm. have a certain influence and capability to change the world rather than some executive sitting at a desk somewhere at a network yeah. that's saying, this is what's good, I'm going to throw a hundred million at it and tell you guys that this is good to watch. Today's vlog was just a mix of two days because it's just been, it's been a great holiday mm -hmm. week, but it's been kind of hard to vlog during this it's time. It's, yeah, between work and then family and kids and like my brain is just. Well, you had to edit the Christmas so vlog and that full. took a while because it no, was it like three look, hours. It doesn't look like, it, it doesn't look as good as it should for taking as long as it did. I don't know. I Maybe you guys liked good. it. If you liked it, you can let us know. But hey, I, I, I mean, yeah, it was cool. It was really fun. <laughs> I don't know why it took so long. It took you a long time, babe. Like that silly Winnie the Pooh thing that I put in there. Yeah. I thought that was really funny. And then afterwards, I was like, oh, I don't know if you can even hear. Mm -mm. You couldn't really hear him say, oh, bother. So I never noticed it. Anyway. But, um, but yeah, so we kind of have a crazy day tomorrow, and I'm looking forward to it. I'm actually kind of excited. I get to go work out. Oh yeah, you and Derek I get to go Huff. hang out with Derek Huff, He's a good friend of mine. Um, but I don't know. I love my dance world and my dance friends, and mm -hmm. they're all so different and so unique. Fun to see Louie. It was so fun to see Louie. I truly... And that is a good story. That's an origin story right there. Yeah. That's good stuff. I, when I say, like, I love, I love everybody, but genuinely, like, love Louie, he is the reason I <laughs> had the success I've had. He's given me opportunities that no other person has ever given me. He let me dance on an off-Broadway show. And I, without that, I would not have been able to do Broadway because I went straight to LA. But he was one of the first to show ballroom dancing in a different light. And he was my coach. He pushed me to my limits. He got me to one of my goals of making um, a final in a world championship. Like, he is truly one of my favorite people 
and he'll flat out tell me if something's not good he'll flat out say Ashley that's not good so he's just very honest and I just adore and I love him so much he's like my lost brother so it was a fun night I know we totally rambled on I just feel like we haven't spoken to you guys in a while either huh yeah it's been a lot of like recording stuff but not a lot of connecting yeah stuff. connecting with you but we are going to say goodnight so you've got a fun Disney trip coming up tell everybody about that yeah. do I haven't said anything I was waiting okay we don't have to say anything a little teaser there little we'll play teaser. A this week, so stay tuned so we're gonna be in LA so. we will be in LA yep fun okay we subscribe I know we say this a lot but Subscribe below if you have any comments or questions. I love Naomi. She totally, I love when she says that. I love when someone was saying, could you please um, use, what did you say, more enjoyment in your voices. Oh, sorry. And uh, it was a long Christmas day and we were yeah. probably up until 4 a.m. Thank you, Bobby Joe, for pointing that out. I know. Well, Bobby Joe, she, she actually stood up <clears throat> for us. So we love you, Bobby Joe. Hi, because no, you're awesome. We, we don't want to put you guys to sleep either, so. No, no, it's totally true. Sorry. But I did watch it and I heard my voice, but literally that was living off of two hours of sleep. But I also can't be Jared Meekum. <laughs> I can. Yes, you can. No, I'm just kidding. Ashley's got the, the no. talk show host personality for, for that, but I don't want to be trying to be somebody else no but. we are who we are i'll have a couple so. of energy drinks before i no do the next vlog we just had great apple pie and ice cream which is awesome sugar crash which i didn't have any sugar all day until that point until the pie so i'm trying to cut back on my <laughs> sugar all right i know we're just talking we just did a whole vlog it's we've been talking for like 11 minutes, minutes. 11 <laughs> 30 11 minutes awesome. so Okay, we love you all love so you much, and we will see you tomorrow. When are we going to April and Davies to visit? Oh, we're going on Saturday. They just had a cute baby. Yeah, so we get to see, see the baby. baby. We're gonna bring them dinner. Mm -hmm. I was hoping Mike wants to do. We have two different ideas of dinner. We'll see who wins. <laughs> I have one idea. We have one. All right. Good night. Okay. Bye. Boom 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 boom